Hi, I'm John Maida, and if you watched episode one, you saw me with Sam Sicalache, Deputy CTO of Microsoft. We're going to hear from Group Product Manager Evan Chalky in a few minutes. But wait, let's talk about Semantic Kernel. Open source Semantic Kernel is available as a LinkedIn learning course. There's two courses now available. And why does this exist? Because there's this person, Blake, in our lives. Blake could be you. Blake is someone who came back to work after December holidays and discovered that their boss used this thing called ChatGPT. And suddenly was asking Blake, hey, can you put this into product immediately, like ASAP? And Blake's kind of busy because Blake's taking care of everything else at the same time. So Blake's spending nights, weekends, learning things like embeddings and new acronyms for terms that Blake's never heard about. But the pressure is still on because your boss just heard about something called GPT-4. And it seems like every week, every day, a new innovation in large language model AI is landing. Blake feels the pressure and wants to over deliver for their boss, looks at the roadmap and says, hey, maybe we can fast track this one thing. And the one thing they want to fast track is this common problem that they have had at Blake's company, taking the famous store operations manual, 10,000 pages, making it easy for any employee to onboard with a copilot for that. Now, the copilot stack is something you heard about at Build from Kevin Scott, CTO of Microsoft. And there's a diagram that lays it out. What is Semantic Kernel? Semantic Kernel is that juicy AI orchestration layer right in the middle. And if you zoom into that, it's a whole playground of enterprise class parts to build a code pilot app yourself. And what we're going to hear in episode next is Evan walking us through that code pilot chat. Are you ready to do it, Evan? Let's do it.